I do. You met Jeff Johnson earlier, who's running for governor. He and I helped represent Minnesota on the Republican National Committee. And when he decided to run for governor, he stepped down, but I stayed on. This is like a ladies and jump, like you have with some of your communities. You have someone who works among different groups, that is a networker that helps connect. And we do that on the political side. But one of the other things that I do is give speeches on the Constitution, the Bill of Rights, the founding of America. And I'm going to give you about a 30 to 45 second summary of why this country is unique and the role that everybody plays in it. You see, there is no country on the planet that has as many ethnicities, races, cultures, nationalities, it doesn't matter how you cut it, belief systems that America has. And almost everybody who came here, came here because they wanted an opportunity here that they could not have over there. And when you heard from Governor Candidate Johnson, both U.S. Senate candidates, because this will be the rare year that you can vote for two U.S. Senators in the same election. So Karen Housley and Jim Neuberger, and Ross Peterson, who's the representative here, Senator Dan Hall. The reason we want you to vote for us is a lot of what Representative Jason Lewis said. If you want opportunity, you want choice of school for your kids, and you want to be able to believe the way you believe without hurting someone else, this is the best place to be, especially today. And when our founders set up the government, they wanted us to control the government. They did not want elected officials. And what has happened in our country is we're losing that grassroots ground control, which is you and I and we want it back. And our party, honestly, is the only one that wants to take the gamble, the risk, and explain to people what is at stake. Because you see, if America fails, if America goes socialistic, there's no place to go. The freedom is here, the choice is here, the opportunity is here. Does it always work? No. Is it always fair? Unfortunately not. We're humans. But think of that when you talk to people in your community. There is an awful lot at stake. 2018, 2016 was important for the United States of America. Thank God we got the home talk. But 2018 is very important for the state of Minnesota. So thank you for, I hope, no more than two minutes. Thank you all for coming out and Keep doing what you're doing and have a wonderful time. Thank you, Janet. Well, I have to say thank you for staying this long. Thank you very, very much. It's a long afternoon. And all the speakers have, um, I think Janet was the last one. So for our community, the message is very clear. Please unite us and don't divide us. There are enough things that divide us in this country. And we don't need a one more thing like data administration to divide us again. And I think that message is loud and clear. And we want to pass that message to our legislators and to support the people who 